Greetings and salutations friends, I hope everyone is doing well. It's your boy Nicholas Che coming back with the first video of 2019. I hope everyone had a happy New Year's and a Merry Christmas. I know I really enjoyed taking the time off to spend it with my friends and my family and just let myself take a break. It was much needed but I am ready to get back to creating content for you guys. I am a little under the weather right now so my voice isn't the best but today I just wanted to make a quick video saying why 2019 will be the best year of my life. If you're new to the channel, welcome. I make videos about college and lifestyle and fashion, photography and film if any of that's sounds interesting make sure you stay subscribed but this video is just kind of me manifesting my goals and my ideas and what I want to happen this year into a single video that way when I can look back on my 2019 I'll be able to you know reminisce and see how far along I came and whether I was able to meet those goals and it will also serve as a little bit of a challenge to not only myself but to you guys as well to you know stay true to your goals and persevere through whatever you guys are wanting to achieve this year there's a lot of exciting things happening in 2019 that I'm so excited for most importantly I'm really focused on a studio at my school called IVX which I will definitely talk more about once it is up and running but right now we're in the process of getting a lot of furniture and equipment and setting up that studio space so we can make it a viable resource for students and professor and faculty and all alike to just create cool content on campus especially because that is so important for the creative community at my college campus. Aside from that I think my YouTube channel is going to be something I'm pursuing a lot more heavily this year just spending a lot more time and energy to make sure that the content I'm creating for you guys is what you guys want to see but at the same time meaningful for me and something that I'm going to enjoy creating now whether that's vlogs or fashion videos or more photography tutorials and also find the time as a college student to find that balance between dedicating however many hours to do this video versus doing my homework etc etc another big priority for me this year is to take care of myself a lot more not just my physical state but also my emotional and my mental health as well I think that it's easy to get caught up being a content creator whose job is literally to just push out content for an audience but this year I really want to focus on taking time for myself especially when I need it and not let the stress and the pressure you know build up and let that affect my work and my energy and my personality towards other people because that is the worst type of energy and I do not need that in my life right now. Now going back to a point that I said earlier, I think it's very important to manifest your ideas into the world and into reality because if there's no physical action behind the words that you're saying, then there's not going to be enough drive or action to get you to where that point it is you need to be. You know, this isn't a new concept or anything and there's been dozens of books written about manifesting your ideas into the world. But honestly, like for me, I think that's something I'm going to try and do a lot more and obviously just be able to document my journey most importantly and be able to tell myself that yes, I reached this milestone. Yes, I was able to, to reach the goals that I had set for myself. As part of that, I have been journaling a lot more lately I think it's very important for me to write down my thoughts any ideas that come to head and not just on a phone but on something like a pen and paper where it's physical and you can look back and be able to say okay I was able to check that off my you know 2019 bucket list or my goals as far as my resolutions for this year if any of you guys are interested I am going to be prioritizing self-awareness I mentioned this in one of my past videos but I think that like being aware of who you are as a person as an individual as a worker as a creator or any type of personality trait really it's very important to know the ins and outs of yourself what makes you tick what kind of people you like to work with or you know what environment is the most beneficial for you and you know and being self-aware is such an important skill to have because in an industry like this or even in college it's easy to get bogged down by what other people are saying or what other people tell you, you should do this or think that way and if you don't have a firm foundation in your own beliefs and in your own values and who you are as a person it's easy to get slipped away in that so I think that's something I'm very much going to try and focus a lot more this year number two is hard work and hustle I mean this has always been a mantra of mine don't stress finesse but you can't get anywhere in life if you don't put in the work behind it and that's something that one of my biggest mentors and role models Gary Vaynerchuk he's a huge entrepreneur if you don't know him I highly recommend checking him out but honestly there will be no point of any of this manifestation bullshit or you know actualizing your goals if there isn't work behind it you're not going to get from point a to point b without putting in the number of hours that it's going to take and at the end of the day it's it's easy for me to you know get bogged down once again in the fact that my vanity metrics you know the number of followers i have or the likes i'm getting isn't up to par or what i want it to be but i need to take time and slow down and realize that there's value in this process of putting out hundreds of videos and you know reaching however many subscribers that I want but at the end of the day like I keep saying and something that I'm going personally going to be focusing on is doing it for the love of it not letting the money or the fame or anything like that get in the way number three something that I've actually been lacking in and something that I'm really trying to develop this year is patience not that I'm a super impatient kid but I would just like to be doing things and having to wait around for stuff isn't what I enjoy so just taking the time to just take a deep breath when things are out of your control there's nothing you can do about about it then you know patience is a very important skill to have number four empathy this is honestly like a daily skill that should be 
you know, practiced and utilized every single day with every interaction you have and all the people in your life and just understanding how your actions not only affect yourself, but also the people around you. I think that's a very important personality trait to have and, and utilizing that every single day is just going to make yourself a happier person. The people around you are going to enjoy hanging out with you a lot more and, and in the long run, it's going to make your life much easier. Number five is traveling, exploring, curiosity. I think this year is a very important time for me to you know, travel as many places I can, experience as many different cultures while I'm still young and let that shape who I am and the things that I know about this world because it's so easy nowadays and it's so flexible and if you don't get out there and do it, you're gonna regret it one day and I think that now when I'm young is the perfect time to do it. So I'm definitely gonna be trying to travel a lot more and figure out the places that I wanna visit. Anyways, that about wraps up for this video. This wasn't anything crazy. I just wanna put something out there because I know I've missed making videos and I hope you guys have missed watching them hopefully <coughs> like i said i am a little sick so this might be it for the next few days but anyways i hope you have a great week i am heading back to school monday so in a few days right now and having to get ready for finals so wish me the best of luck for that i will try and put out videos as often as i can but as always don't stress finesse